Almost five dozen guns are out on the streets tonight after a string of break-ins at gun stores in one county. News Channel 5's Kyle Haran shows us how detectives hope to track those guns and thieves down. The same type of vehicle was carjacked from an individual in Nashville, uh, I believe on the 14th. Take a close look. Closer. Video from the outside shows the moment of impact when the car smashes into guns and more in Smyrna. Inside, it shows the chaos as several suspects grab shotguns, rifles, ammunition. Now look closely at this person. Do you recognize them? They are dangerous individuals, and now that they're armed, it makes them even more dangerous. For Smyrna police, it's hard to tell whether or not these are the same suspects from other burglaries in the area. But the description of this car matches one missing from a carjacking. The description matches one from a police chase with Hendersonville police. Bobby Gibson does want to get to the bottom of this. We don't know for certain on that. Obviously, that's an avenue we're going to try to pursue and see if there is a connection on that. We do believe that these individuals are involved in other burglaries or robberies that have happened in the Middle Tennessee area. In total, the stolen gun count is pressing 60. A spokesperson for the ATF believes some of these guns could have been recovered in recent arrests. They're checking serial numbers with those stolen from gun stores to see if they match. Gun stores where these brazen burglars are getting away with thousands of dollars of firearms and ammunition. We're hoping because of that, it will allow us to recognize, someone will recognize these individuals and give us a lead that we can follow and hopefully bring them into custody. So look closely. Do you know her? Kyle Haran, News Channel 5. And police say these guns are now on the streets and as the holidays approach, they're saying be wary where you buy those guns. Reporting in Smyrna, Kyle Haran, News Channel 5. Kyle, thanks. Law enforcement's offering a $7,000 reward for information leading to an arrest.